My name is Paolo Vines, I am professor of epidemiology here at Imperial College. Uh, we are doing a, a new research uh, which is funded by the European Commission. It is called uh, Exposomics. Uh, it combines uh, two types of uh, measurements. Uh, uh, measurements in the environment, um, air, water and food, uh, and measurements uh, in uh, molecules in our bodies, uh, DNA, RNA, proteins, uh, metabolites because we want to see uh, the effects of external exposures uh, on uh, such uh, molecules uh, to explore the um, biological implications of exposure to so many chemicals. So small molecules such as amino acids, sugars and lipids are key components of uh, biological systems and they're involved in a wide range of uh, processes in those systems including signaling and build it as building blocks of, of bigger molecules such as proteins and DNA. The work we do here at Imperial College in the Department of Surgery and Cancer is we use high resolution spectroscopic techniques to characterize biological systems and in the context of the Exposomics project we're going to be using human blood samples taken from populations uh, people in uh, populations in Europe and we're going to be looking at how the, the composition of those biofluids change in relation to environmental uh, stresses. so in this case in relation to environmental uh, pollutants. And we're also interested in how those metabolites reflect processes that lead to disease, so chronic diseases such as cancer and cardiovascular disease. Uh, the instruments we have uh, here in this laboratory include nuclear magnetic resonance spectroscopy and uh, mass spectrometry equipment. So what we'll be doing in collaboration with others in the exposomics project is we'll be trying to relate metabolite changes we see in human blood samples to uh, environmental pollutants and the idea is to try and tie those together with other omics platform measurements uh, within the project such as gene expression uh, profiling and epigenomic uh, regulation um, experiments that we can try and tie those, those, to get those together to gain a, a greater understanding of the biology that links the environment to disease.